Good morning, friends. Welcome to Azure Talks. Uh, this is your host, Umesh Pandit. Uh, okay, so there was a uh, few questions uh, all together came from Melbourne, uh, where uh, a particular uh, a AI um, a eventualist wanted to understand how we can actually go for uh, the examination uh, registration okay, for the first time. So recommended approach is to use Outlook account. Do not use your uh, Gmail accounts. And since I've already cleared AL 100, I will not be able to schedule it. To give you a better example, I'm just choosing DP 100. Google it, Google it in a way that it will show you the first with Microsoft link. Make sure that the link is coming in from HTTPS learn.microsoft.com and you click on it. Once you click here, go down a little bit and then say schedule the exam. Now this price will vary according to your country. So let's suppose I'm doing it from India. I'll just select India. Okay, so once I've selected India, it will show me the updated pricing, which is 4,800 rupees. Plus it will have the GST as well. Okay, so go and make sure that you are scheduling the examination like this by clicking the schedule exam. Once you schedule, click on the schedule exam, it will try to look for your profile, which has been registered with Microsoft. If you are not registered for the Microsoft for the first time, no problem. Select any exam, select any exam and then you will have this uh, profile uh, blank profile to you fill in all the details make sure that you select the correct legal name same legal name document will be verified you when you go for an examination so it is very very important that this name will be exactly with your photo identity card like your deal uh, maybe you are going for passport you go for the passport so passport will have the first name and the last name same first name and last name should be there as a legal name otherwise you will be not be allowed to give the exam Okay, now go to the next page. Now based on your recent activity with Microsoft or with your company, or if you are an MCT or an MVP, you will have 75% of the discount on the Microsoft examinations. If you are a Microsoft partner company uh, employee, you will have 50% discount. Uh, I'm an MCT, so I will go with, I will not go with the uh, corporate company. I will go with the 75% discount, obviously, yeah. Go and apply. Once it is applied, go in next choose it will ask you to get the scheduling done with the bsnb okay uh, and also over here you will show you it will show you your mcp id mcid which is microsoft certification identity number and it will try to if you see the url correctly it is showing exam registration.microsoft.com it will now switch back to switch to the PSN UE and if in case you want to appear for a in-person test, you can go and in-person and look for uh, the ID and whatnot, or in case, and then it will tell you what which location it has. So I'm in India, it will show you all Indian locations uh, based on your country selection. Right now I am looking for online. Online is the best one. It is a comfort of your home. You can do it from hotel, you can do it from your home. You can do it from anywhere on the earth, should not be an issue, okay? where you have the connectivity you can do you can uh, it the the main criteria is that the uh, your uh, room should be locked within and you should be able to give the examination in a very silent place okay once you do uh, make sure that uh, your computer tests you run it why a computer running test is important it might be a case that your video is not working your raw, your internet is not sufficient so you can troubleshoot it before giving the examination it's the best way to schedule the examination. If this test pass, go ahead and look for the next. Choose the language in which you want to give. Mostly people will select English. Yeah, obviously you can select Arabic or Chinese based on your language preferences. Go to all these options and then select as an yes. Without making yes, you cannot proceed. So go next. Then there will be an um, uh, online agreement which you want to make on the data processing and the online policies yeah, always everything should be selected yes there will be artificial intelligence on the facial comparison policy and then once you are done say agree once you agree it will ask you whether you want to go with the chinese or uh, whether you want to go with the japanese or english language obviously you will be an english speaking person go to next and then 
uh, Calcutta or Asia go and select yes it will select the time zone based on your country's time zone you can select it and then pick and choose which date you want I'm looking for 14 February maybe the Valentine Day I want to spend with Microsoft giving the examination <laughs> okay so go and have the uh, uh, the timings so you can pick and choose this 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. slot or you can explore more times like this and let's just suppose you choose for this anything around 17 17 oh so this is 5 p.m. IST go and book it so once you confirm it will tell you to review it once you review you can go ahead and proceed for the checkout now it is also gives me the discount details and what I want to pay so just click on the pay on the next page it will tell you okay which visa card you want to apply most of the time I have seen American Express and MasterCard works okay so this is all billing information say next once this is done it is not still paid next page it will show you uh, to uh, uh, the review and then it will next page it will show you the payment information so I will not be sharing this obviously and uh, you have a good examination thank you for listening to me uh, please do share comment and like this particular video um, thank you very much you have a great day ahead thank you bye bye